All right. All right, again, this time we work the traditional Aikido Kote Gyashi. Yes. Yeah, here. Just go ahead and put it on me. All right. Like, do it to me. Go ahead. No, just. And this is this is without me attacking you. All right. Now I'm going to put it on you. So, and you resist it. So here, I'm, I'm fighting, I'm forcing, and all this kind of crap, which I don't need to do. I'm just going to hit you here. And down you go. I got here, comes up here. Make that a table, okay? And then this hand is, is, it's not useless, but it's not necessary. I could just set it here. I have this here, this is what. Because I'm using my entire body instead of just my arms. So as you grab here, I got here. You have to do that. I just bring in here. It's a very short cut. It's a very, yes. Instead of going with Gaku, like this, I just bring it up here like this here. Because okay. I'm just going to do this anyway. There. <laughs> <laughs> so as soon as you grab either one, so I can bring it up here. This hand just slides right here. And then from here, I can just hold it. And I have you locked up right there. Alright. And then if I want to... Oh. <laughs> so we try, you want to try that one? Alright. I'm kind of trying to absorb that one because I can only let what the guy see was like thumb to the fourth finger. Thumb to the fourth. That's a very traditional way of doing it, yes. <laughs> it doesn't have to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to have to relearn that one. Gayakute Dori. All I'm doing is palm up, and then I can just reach in here, and I've got, I've already got it, right there. Uh -huh. Right there. Now, if I want to turn, I can bring it down. I find it works better from God here. If I want to do this version of Kote Kiyashi, I find that it works better once I get you down here. Uh -huh. Once I have you here, then I can. I can do the more traditional code. Yeah, because I'm just only supported on my Yeah, because you're name. not going to resist that. Up top, we got to fight. Uh -huh. Fighting takes energy. And then got a lot of support. Yes. Yeah. So as soon as, as soon as you hook up, boom, here, I'm here. And I have this. And as you step in, see, now I'm already close as I want here. And I just go down. I'm right here. And I get up close to you here. I can use my elbow. Yes, so I'll grab you, Kai Kute Dori. Oh, oh, yes, oh, oh, oh. that's the reverse. You can do that. How do you do that then? Palm up. Palm up. Your free hand just comes in and grips oh. right here. Then you can go to the knee part. Whoop. And of course, I like to step on the foot. Yeah. Yeah. Right, see? Palm up. Palm up. Reach in and grip. Just, just yep. That. Yep. That's it. Because now I've got this. Now I've got what I want right here. And then boom. And if you do that, you don't have to be quick at it, but if you do it decent, here, I'm here, boom, here, I'm... This, this hand is free most of the time anyway. So from here, just... You don't even have to... There, just, there you go, just like that. Okay. Yep. There, right there. Now it goes in, just like... There it is. Oh, and then the table. And just the table, yep. And then but from there, from there, if you want to turn me, you can turn me from there. And then you can do your regular Kota Gashi okay. from there. You can grip it here and just do your regular Kota Gashi. Boom. Because I have less movement. Because if I'm up here, and I'm trying to do Kota Gashi like a traditional, this one, I've got to contend with your movement, because you can move. Yeah. You can fight me, and we're fighting here. But as soon as I get you down here, See how off balance you are already? All right, I'm just stepping on my foot. <laughs> and, and I stepped on your foot, yes. All right, I better relearn the whole thing. 
Oh, so this is just to hold the hand. That's just to hold the hand. And then this is where the technique comes, right and there. Then right, right there. Yes. Oh. Yeah, as soon as you grab Gakute, this just comes in here. And I like to use my fatness. I'll step in on you. Here. Because oh. see now, now I've got this, see how it's trapped? <laughs> and then I've got Hijigate here. Ooh. <laughs> So as soon as you grab, I step in and I get this here just like this, and I hold you. Now I can go to a hundred different moves. I can use a hijiate, I can go to the hijiate this way, I can go to an actual ikkyo, I can go into a kote this way, but like I said, I like to get down first. And then, back to the room, I'll get Yeah, everyone doesn't get that one. Yeah. And that's the guy for the room. Let me absorb this the way. There you go. Yep. Yep. That's so, it. Yep. The one that you told me back then was this. Yes, that's that's a Gayaku Kote Gyashi. That's a reverse. So this is like a super variation. And right there, yes. And then that's just a regular Kote Gyashi from a Gaku Te uh -huh. Yep, just like that. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> Because what I was taught back then was this, to do this, to do this, and then Bum. you release. Now I've got, yeah. Yeah, good. go through that whole thing from back to take away. Oh. <laughs> yeah, right. That's the first thing, first thing I'm going to do. Here, go ahead. Bam! Kick, whatever, boom, I'm going to take you down and do whatever I want. Yeah. That's the guess. So first of all, you need to hold me if you're going to do that. So your hand will have to come up and grip me, and then you can turn me if you want. Turn like, like do the regular. Well, do the regular. Like okay, oh, if, you're okay. Gonna, if you're gonna spin me like this in a real in a real life situation, are you gonna hang on to me no. like that? You're not. You do that. Yeah. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna regrip you, and I'm gonna bring you in this way, and I'll have you turn, and then if I want to go through the kote gashi, I'll put a kote gashi on you. But that's a lot of movement. Exactly. And why go through all that when I can just do this? <laughs> it's, it's, it's quicker, in my opinion. Lesser motion, it, it lesser movement. It's definitely quicker. There's no argument that, it, that it's not quicker. In my opinion, it's more practical and better. Because even if I want to turn it here, I got this elbow I'm popping you in the face with, right? Yep. And I bring you down here. And say you wiggle out of that. That's okay. You wiggle out of that. You can wiggle out of that. And I'll bring you in here. And I still have it locked up. I'm like, okay, we can get up now. Go ahead and let's get up. Oh, wait. Maybe I don't want you up yet. It's just maintain control. Simple, easy, effective without doing a bunch of crazy. Yeah. Gaiakute, kote gyashi, right there, boom, and then wham. Okay. A little bit quicker than the old way, right? Yeah. Okay. That's simple. <laughs> Here? No, that's different. That is different. I'm, I'm moving you a little different. It's, it's the same principle. Yeah. I have you here. It's almost like a shihonage. It is very much like a shihonage. But it's not behind me. Yes. Because I like to have your neck. And go right into the arm bar. Yes, it's very much the same. As it like a shiho, shiho mm -hmm. up here, yeah. and I have a shiho here. Or I come out to the outside, I have a shiho here. With the kote version, I'm just down yeah, here, and then from here I can bring you out here, and then we can have a little discussion yeah. about what you did to upset me so much, <laughs> and I'm sure you apologize for that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Wait a minute.
Well, how come yours looks so efficient that one? <laughs> well, I've been doing it for 15 oh. years, <laughs> and you haven't. That's probably the first time. Yeah, here. Um, do you remember when we do the Shiho? We're like this, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. It's pretty much the same thing, but instead of going to the side of you, it's more forward. I'm staying forward here. And I'm taking the energy from here, straight down your elbow, and I'm slamming it into the ground here. Boom, so bam. Now I have all that energy right there. Now from here I can just break your wrist, yeah. just by going pop. Yeah, because it's all the way down. Yes. The muscles got no way. And it doesn't use any energy. I don't use any energy. Because when you grab me, it's just me sitting down. Me going to Kiza. I love this technique, Kiza. It's uh, it's not Seiza. Seiza is sitting. But Kiza is up on one leg. This, in my opinion, is one of my favorite positions to be in when I'm moving people around, if I'm not completely on the ground. Because I can maintain control so of a person on the ground, and I can still look around. And this is good for throwing people off your back. So, which we do at uh, Hijiate that way. So, from Gakute Dori here, with the Hijiate I grab here, I go here, oh, yeah. and then throw you over. Which, if you notice, is the technique on my business card. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Probably yeah. my favorite technique. I, I know it's the Hiji like, series. I know, I know you like Hiji Yate, but it didn't occur to me that's the semi kneeling position. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I chose that particular picture because I love that technique. I mean, I did that intentionally try to fall that time. Well, well, once <laughs> you really dropped me there. Once I once I have you here, boom, I'm here. Okay, I use part of my leg. Oh, I did not see that. Yeah, I use part of my leg. Okay, now I can go here to the side and throw you this direction, but I use less energy when I throw you here, because what I'm really doing is I'm using this movement this direction, the hijiate this direction, and I'm also stopping the leg here, so I'm boom. And now I have an arm bar. See how slow we're going? I'm not falling because I really want to. If I don't roll, I'm going down. Mm -hmm. There, yes, yeah. there, there. Okay. Yes, you feel how you had my balance? Keep stepping on the back end of this, it won't stay up. Oh, I have to take away. Well, now we're fighting. Now, now you're in trouble. Oh, wait now you completely lost everything. <laughs> yeah, I lost everything. Yes. Okay, so as soon as you grab the eye container, all right, I bring it up just like this. I want your palm to be up. Palm up. And I want to be in close enough to where your elbow is bent slightly. Okay. Okay? Now, I like to step on the foot, of course. Okay, so I'll, I'll do this. And I'll step even closer to you. So now you're pinned. So if you want to move that arm, it's going to be harder for you to move that arm. Well. Yeah. So as soon as I pin you here, I just grab both of, both of them here. I can grab like this if I want to rip your fingers apart. That tear is pretty easy. Here. And just push down. And then I got you locked up here. Uh, now, you get squirrely with this and I'm going to crack. Or if you've got a buddy. I just go ahead and step on it here so that I can still feel you. You can move if you want, but I can feel you. Yeah. And I can still look around. And I'm here. 
And then this can come down here on it. And I can put yep, right there on that. And if I get mean about it, I don't just turn and sit. I turn and go bam. And that hurts. <laughs> I thought it was just a little pressure. Though. Yes. There you go. Yes, right there. All right. Okay. So all right. I guess my words are taking me. No, no. <laughs> Do that again. There you go. Okay. There, there. You do this. If I force with this, I can't. Put Once that. you start forcing it, you lose it. Either one here, diaphragm. Yes. I'm bringing it in here. Oh, I'm not doing the closer thing. Yes. Because if I try it way out here, then we're fighting. Because mm -hmm. I don't have that. So you can move around everywhere you want, and just move around any way you want. So really, know you're moving around. Mm -hmm. Okay. But now move around. Ow. See now you have. Now here I'm in perfect position for the normal kote gyashi because now you can't fight it. So when you do regular kote gyashi, do it while they're down on their knees. Boom! There now you can do regular kote if you want. Boom! Oh. And here, I have you locked up here. Now we're buddies. Your other elbow was on my shoulder. How did you do that? Oh, I just, from here, when I brought you down here, I just push on your shoulder here. Now, I can take you forward, because you're, you're, I can feel you're leaning forward. So, I don't want to push you backwards. I'll push you forward and lock you up here. And then I'll look around and make sure no one's watching. So does that mean I can do